Brian, the parkour export, export, expert. Back at it again. Up here. Jump. Nope. I missed that one. I'm going back over here, though. So... Can we even make that? Yeah, we... Oh, yeah, we can. But I messed up. Okay. There. There. See, I love creative... Oh, nope. Go back up. I love creative mode that you, like, you can just restart instead of, like... Because we would have died easily right back there over and over and over again. And then I would have gotten really frustrated. Here we go. No music block. I have found four of twelve. Cool. So, although we've cheated quite a bit, we, uh, we're still finding a good amount of the music discs. So that's good. And uh, come back over here. There we go. All right. So we found that nice and easy. Let's go to Bowser's airship over here. We've uh, explored that little bit of the map. That's pretty good. Now, I'm curious... What is this? Iron Sword. Okay. Um, I'm wondering if they'll actually launch us into the air. This will be interesting like they did in the Fallout one. Oh, yes, they will. But I don't have the wings. So this should be interesting. Here we go. And it'll explode. Boom. Oh, we didn't need the Elytra. Cool. Awesome. We could just fly over that way. Oh, these are... These are... Bouncies. These are bouncy bouncies. Okay. Uh, so, you're supposed to... No, fly. Here we go. Alright, we're going to try that one more time. Back up here. So, we land right here. Boom. And then we jump. Jump. There we go. Back over here, maybe? Nope. That's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. Let's see. So we would jump from over here and over here, jump over here. There we go. Uh, what secrets do- ooh! Bullet Bills. What secrets does Bowser's airship hold? There's nothing at the top of the ship like I thought there would be. Now if we go... Over- ooh, there's obstacles here. Lapis Lazuli Compact Blocks. Okay, there's no Captain's Quarters that I'm seeing. And on the side here? No, it's not. Uh, what about up here? At the helm of the ship. Anything I can do? It's a warp pipe, but the warp pipe doesn't really go anywhere. Okay. Uh, do these buttons do something? Doesn't look like it either. Okay. So, there's Bowser's airship. There may be more secrets lying within here, and I just don't know about them, but definitely... Oh, yeah, there's all sorts of other stuff down there. Go and explore for yourself. So, uh, I don't want to spoil it too much for you, nor do I want to spend too much time figuring this stuff out, because i got a lot more to explore, so... Okay, let's go to this creepy-looking Bowser thing in the middle of the ocean. I don't know what game this is supposed to be from, but, uh, let's find out. Ooh, it looks like we're heading to the Nether. Ooh, so that's Nether Brick and all that fun stuff. Let's, uh, let's dive right deep in. Okay, cool, we're, we hopped right into it. And, ooh, so we have a Dry Bones, a Skeleton Skull, that's a, that's a Bowser portrait right there, a Giant Bullet Bill, that's pretty awesome, uh, let's see, so I don't know what world this is supposed to reflect, if it's any part of any game, I know it's really cool regardless, a uh, Block of Iron, and, oh, the, I mean, the environment's really cool, I really like it so far. Uh, let's see. Got a fireball over here. Or should we have gone up that way? Ooh. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Is this stuff over here? I think that's Bowser's Castle. Yes, that is Bowser's Castle. We could go over there as well. Uh, looks like we can't jump that way. So we'll go this way. Jump. 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 There we go. Okay. So, ah, nope, go up there. Cool, thank you. Now, again, I know I've said this. We're going to limit our jumping in creative mode. We're going to exclusively try to do it in survival. There we go. Ah, uh, let's see. That is a buzzy beetle up there, or rather, none. Well, the buzzy beetle, I think, is exclusively the flying one. Ooh, nope, blocks. Cool. Ah, uh, let's keep going this way. Still can't kind of piece together what level this is supposed to be. Ooh, we got an underground part over here. 
And can I get a... No. Bedrock cannot be broken. Ooh, okay. So, there goes that idea. Now, where would my, uh... Is it up here? Dispenser. Yeah, I'm like, okay, where, where's our, uh... Our handy-dandy mine cart? Uh, can I go? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Go. Go. Thank you. Marching on. Marching on. Go, go, go. Yep. Let's go. Yep. There we go. Okay, cool. So, no. No, no, no. Get out. Get out. Cool. Hey, Dry Bones. How you doing? Good to see ya. Hope you're doing okay. Oh, we went the wrong way. Oops. We went the wrong way. We're supposed to climb up this way from all the way down here. Oops. My bad. Uh, we're gonna skip over to Bowser's Castle. Because that is probably the biggest main attraction y'all probably want to see. Oh, that's Bowser. Ah, oh, we're spoiling it for ourselves. Go back over here. Front entrance. Front entrance. There we go. Yeah, cool. Here it is. Front entrance, Bowser's Castle. Hi. So I should have probably figured that Bowser was actually inside the nether near his own castle rather than in the uh, overworld with Mario and the rest of them. So here we go. Uh, presume Nope. Death consumed me. I am so happy we are in creative mode, because otherwise, again, I would be so aggravated that I kept dying and dying again. Uh, there's one lever. Don't know what that does quite yet, but we'll figure it out. And presumably there's another one of equal uh, height. What is... Okay, that's a lava pool. Lava whirlpool. Presumably there's another one of equal difficulty. Oops. Of equal difficulty on this side uh kinda maybe yeah right there get it get it right there yeah there we go cool what about over here ooh there's another door click and go back up here 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 oh no is door unlocked yes it is all right door number one is unlocked now, ooh, it's like an, it's not, no, it's not the infinite staircase. It's kind of reminiscent of it, but not entirely fully. Ooh, there's Bowser. Oh, da 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 ba da 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 We definitely haven't seen him before. Not at all, not even a little bit. Okay. Let's, uh, fly over here. And, ooh, that looks like a enemy, but it's actually not. Imagine if, like, they somehow magically got Bowser to be, like, completely animated and he was like doing a boss battle against you that'd be really cool that's uh that's something that absolutely cannot happen in minecraft even if you tried but that would still be really cool oh we can actually go down there but uh we'll go across the way over here just to make sure there are any other goodies inside of here nothing inside of here and nothing up here what about up top Anything up top? No, just a giant fireball of death. Okay. Let's see what's down here. Anything? Uh, maybe at Bowser's feet, there's a way to blow him up? That'd be really cool. That'd be really, really cool if you could just blow Bowser to bits. Uh, let's see. Still don't have any, uh... What is it called? Mobs? We still, we're still in peaceful mode, even though we are in creative mode now still. Um, just wanted to keep it clear, and I'm surprised this guy actually isn't on fire. Surprised Bowser is actually not on fire. That I thought that was a way for us to get inside of him, legitimately, but it turns out it's not. Wow. Actually, really cool to see how they, uh, build Bowser. I don't know if they did this entirely inside of a computer, or if it's a, it's a custom model or something, like... If they took maybe a render of Bowser and just transferred it into Minecraft blocks, but that's uh, that's really cool. Especially if this was all handmade, that'd be pretty sweet. I doubt it, but it would still be pretty sweet. Oh, that's actually made out of wood. That's pretty cool. Gives gives it a nice uh, shell feel. That's uh, probably a block of emerald right there. That's pretty awesome. Cool. So there's Bowser. That's the Nether. Again, explore it for yourself. Anything inside of Bowser? Is it a uh, you know Bowser's inside story? No. Nothing inside of there. Cool. All right. I'm going to meet you guys back up in the overworld, as a matter of fact. Okay, so now back up in the overworld, there's Luigi, the Bowser's airship, and we have everything explored except for the top left region of the map. So why don't we take a look over there? 
I'm gonna try not to fly. I'm gonna explore it kind of the way they want me to. We'll see. We'll see if we can go through here. Uh, right by Luigi's feet. So there's no way to get up inside of him at all. He's actually, he's just a statue. That would be cool if somehow they had some Easter eggs from within inside each of the models. Like inside of Bowser, there's some tribute to Bowser's Inside Story, which is a game that you can play on, I believe, the, uh, the 3DS. Yes, that's it. Yeah, that, that'd be it. Hey, pony! You're just a regular pony. Okay. And I can't jump now because I need to press A to get through the tutorial. Cool. Horses, donkeys, mules, blah, blah, blah. Horses tame. And they no longer dismount A. Cool. And can I jump now? No, I cannot. Nope, nope. Tame donkeys and mules can give in saddlebags for chess. Donkeys, but not mules, can be bred with other animals using golden apples. Cool. So we will get to that eventually when I'm not playing through the Super Mario World, but in a, uh, a regular survival series, maybe eventually. So we have a pokey over here. All this section of the map is filled out. Well, not the whole thing, but um, as you may or may not know, I am actually not a fan of any real desert levels inside of any game. So I was playing through Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, and I messed that up big time right here. Um, I was playing through Breath of the Wild, and it turns out like the whole like Gerudo part where you have to, uh, you know, dress up as a girl and you have to sneak inside of the main village and defeat the Divine Beast. I actually really dislike most of the desert parts that happen, especially in Zelda. That's the most recent one I've played. But just in general, I'm just not a fan of, uh, of desert themed things because I'm not, I guess I'm just not a fan of the hot weather. Well, I know for a fact I'm not a fan of the hot weather, but I guess I'm just not a fan of the desert look in general. It's not very appealing to me, not even a little bit. That is a typical Minecraft uh, temple that we can discover over here. Uh, that's just a normal, regular temple that I'm surprised they actually put inside of the game. And let's see. We can dig through here. And that's going to all explode now. Yeah, it all exploded. Ha <laughs> ha, there we go. No secrets to lie beneath here. Oh well, that's okay though. So make sure you note of that if you happen to go inside of a desert temple. Do not step in the middle part. That is a sunken pirate ship that actually looks really cool. Really love that effect, even though it's super blocky like in Minecraft. That's awesome. So even though it's nighttime in the desert, it's still... Relatively cool. We're not overheating at all. So, ooh, there's Toad over there. We still haven't seen any of Toad or in the, uh, the, uh, snowy part over here. So, I guess we should go back over here, explore this a little bit more. Uh, so we would go over here, past these arches, or rather these bones. Must be something inside of here. That's cool. Maybe, ooh, it's a moon. It's an eclipse sort of thing. And we would go over here, presumably toward the snowy area. Kind of. Can't get on top of there? No, we cannot. Okay. So let's see. Ooh, there's a temple over here. Or rather a pyramid, not a temple. There's a, a village down here. And um, that looks... Uh, I don't know what game this is from. Maybe Super Mario 3, 2? Two? I'm not sure. We'll go inside of it just to give it a give it a quick look here. Oh, it's not really that complex. Let's see if we can parkour this a legitimate way. Ha! Huh. One, two, and three, four. Oh, do we have to go all the way around? No. Nope, just up here. There we go. Nope. Okay, cool. Over here. And there's a diamond helmet. Ooh, the penguin suit is for the diamond set. That's pretty cool. Is there other pieces over here? No, it's just that one piece. Okay, that's all right. I will take it. So you can explore that part if you want to. But again, I won't be exploring that much of the map. I want you to explore it for yourself, including that, that pyramid. You can go inside of there. Ooh, so now we're heading toward the Boo Mansion. Zabu Manchon. So we fly over here, and then that's it. Well, 
You navigate the woods down below. Let's see if we can navigate the woods. See if we can get through here in one piece. Hey, cow. Hey, cow. You're an all star. Get your game on. Down. Play. We can navigate these woods just fine. They're not that difficult. Yeah, look at that. Nope, actually, yeah, over here. Okay, there's the, there's the steps. Ooh, what goodies in here? Oh, iron sword. We already have plenty of stuff. I think we'll be good. Spruce fence, you are no match. You are no match for me, good sir. Can I go inside? There we go. Ooh, all right, too bad we can't get actually something out of here by pressing our head against it. Oh, well. There's a door inside of here. Oh, this is a whole big complex thing. Okay, so I'm not gonna show you this part. You can look at that one for yourself. I can't get out of here, okay. Oops, I guess I am showing you part of it. <laughs> I guess I am. Let's see. And is this the quick entrance uh, exit out? Nope, that's just one of them. That does something. Presumably that does indeed do something. So there's only two switches. Get it? Switch? Haha. -ha, that I need to unlock. Oh no, there was that one door right there. Okay. Uh, oh, it's very fitting that it's during the nighttime too. That's awesome. So we can't open this door here. Why don't we... Um, item frame. Okay. Well, that doesn't really help us all that much, does it? Right? Oh, there's Mario, that's cool. Um, imagine if you align the pictures all the right way. Then it, Oh, there it is, there's a staircase right there. I didn't even see that. Um, imagine if you aligned the books all in the same way. That's how you solve the puzzle. That'd be pretty cool. But again, something that just doesn't happen in Minecraft, unfortunately. There we go, there's this part. Ooh, no more parkour, haha, -ha. more parkour. Hardcore parkour. You go up here. We're at the top, we're at the tippity top, or we're close. Okay, so there's, ooh, how do you do this? Oh, we have to go to the other side? Right, yeah, through here? No, how do we, oh, I got, oh no, I got you, right here. So you need to do this? Nope, sprint, there it is, cool, awesome. Jump here, and down here, and then that should be unlocked, presumably at the very bottom, yes. Yes, at the very bottom down here, there we go. Okay, deeper inside the Boom Mansion we go. Is this our exit? Hopefully. Um. Uh, is it gonna go? There we go. Oh, we're out. Cool. Oh, and then we complete the level. That's awesome. Sweet. So we can't jump up there. And what's our reward is another music disc. Hey, so actually for completing each of the levels, you get a music disc. I should have known that from a while ago, but that's okay. Let's get out of here, man. Ooh, and then another minecart section. Where shall we go? Let's fill out our part of our map here. Okay, so that's the very, very top left. Let's get out of here, Scoobs. Nope, it launched me into the block. Okay. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Right here. Now. Nope. Oh, it's it is it gonna go? Is it gonna go? Is it gonna go go go? Go 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 gonna go go go. Not as quick as I wanted to, but that's okay. Controls are still confusing me. Oh, I still look really cool. Okay. Uh I'm out. And, oh, warp pipe. Let's warp pipe it up. Oh, and now, okay, now it'll explode and launch me into the air. Awesome. Oh, there we go. Cool. So now that was the Boom Mansion. That's pretty cool. Now let's go over to presumably the final section, the, the winter section, which is always my absolute favorite part of any Mario game over here. So we have the classic castle to our right we have toad you know what let's explore this over here let's go inside of the classic castle hopefully we uh oh i did the parkour all in one bit get some uh goodies inside of here perhaps our our princess will be inside of this castle hopefully can't confirm that for sure but i certainly hope so i died okay 
Now that's the thing with Mario, is there are typically checkpoints and such. Ooh, music disc, that was pretty easy. All right. Typically, there are checkpoints. However, there haven't been any so far. So if you are trying to do this without dying at all, all the power to you. I don't know if I could ever do it. I can almost confirm 100% I would never be able to do it. So let's go over this way. And... Oh, I forget what game those guys are from. And I'm not entirely sure. This is supposed to be... Um... Not a thwomp. Ah, I can't think of this guy. Ah, if I knew what game this was supposed to be based on... These guys are from Super Mario Galaxy, I know that. Right? I know that, kinda. Cool. There's Toad! Hey, Toad has no smile. That's a little creepy. I love the effect that they that they used right here to do the pupils on the eyes. That's sweet. That looks pretty realistic, especially from far away. Or it looks accurate. I shouldn't say realistic, it looks accurate. So let's go... There's this over here. We jump up here if we wanted to. Go over here. It doesn't seem like there's much of a, like an actual level part over here. Well, there's this part. Let's fill out our map right here. Okay. And... Oh! There's, there's this part. What's this? That's an axe. And inside of here is more parkour. Hardcore parkour. Hardcore parkour. And a cake! Aw! We have a cake! Awesome. So there's that. And, um... Dispenser for spawning a slime. Oh, if we were, um... If we were not in creative mode, that's how we would do it. Okay, cool. So there's that part. Now let's see if there's anything else before we kind of end off the little mini-series over here. There's another uh, castle inside of there. Is there any... Ooh, what's this? A little mini-airship. Is there any secrets inside of here? Probably not. Nah, it's just something you look at from the distance. Like, that's really cool. What I wish they had in Minecraft, especially considering this type of map right over here. Oh, there's Petey Piranha. We haven't actually looked at him properly. Um, they should have a, a segment of Minecraft, especially considering these types of map packs, where you can go and basically copy and paste things from any type of world and be able to input that in your game. So, like, if I wanted to take Petey Piranha and put him in my custom creative world, or even in my survival world or something, there would be an ability to do that, where basically, from the main menu, you have a selection of, oh, I can summon the Bomb Bomb King, and boom, place it right there, or Peach's Castle, boom, there it is. Or, you know, a Chain Chomp or something. That would be really cool if they had something like that. Ooh, there's Wiggler over here, we didn't get a good look at him already, or her already, or it already. Um, but yeah, so this has been the Super Mario World, that's where we started off, right over there. Um, again, I did not explore every single little bit and section because I want you to go and explore this for yourself. Once you get the Nintendo Switch Edition, or the, or the Wii U Edition, you get this pack absolutely free. No additional charge for this world or the texture pack at all, so... That's going to conclude my multi-part series showing you the entire Super Mario World. I've been your host, Brian. I'll see you next time when we play some Minecraft on the Nintendo Switch or something else entirely different. I hope you have a great day, and I will talk to you soon. See you later. Bye!